I'm going to now start adding objects. So the third thing that I would do is to add some objects. I'm going to click place and you can see how there's different categories as well. In this case I'm going to click first on nature and, I'm gonna, and there's different um, categories within this and then I'm going to click on um, let's say a click on this converse. Click on this and I'm just going to select it and after that I can start placing it randomly. And this will allow you also to create a more uh, complete scene and so on. If you happen to need to delete something, you can go back here and select. In this case, I'm going to have nature selected. I'm going to have delete here. Delete, and it starts deleting things. Again, all of these different delete options can be found in the tutorial for more information. So, I kind of uh, like this. So we've already imported our model. We've already learned how to add some sort of materials. We've already uh, added some objects. And we've modified our landscape. The last thing is we want to just allow this lighting to be you know, a little bit better for our model. So on, you can just simply uh, place that in, in a different directions and so on. So we can also change some of the clouds. So, okay. so after you complete, so go take some time, add some materials, add some objects, and after you've done all of that, we continue to the next part, which would be to create our render panoramic images.